Ben. Deputy Speaker, the signing of the eighth Community Pharmacy Agreement is a win for patients who will benefit from cheaper medicines and the sector who will provide more pharmacy services. Community pharmacies in my electorate did the heavy lifting during the pandemic and work hard to provide health care to the residents of Bean. Yesterday, with the Minister for Health and Aged Care and Assistant Minister for Mental Health, I visited the award-winning Capital Chemist Southlands to discuss what the eighth CPA means for them. This new agreement will support them to ensure that residents of Bean continue to get cheaper medicines, while at the same time support our community pharmacies to do the critical work they do. This new agreement will freeze medicine co-payments for patients for up to five years and increase the number of free medicine Webster packs that pharmacies can deliver by 50 per cent, paid for by the Commonwealth. Deputy Speaker, this new agreement will give community pharmacies more financial certainty and will support a sustainable pharmacy network across Australia. The Albanese government was determined to deliver an agreement that was good for patients and good for community pharmacy. And this week, Deputy Speaker, this is what we delivered in terms of that commitment. Mm -hmm.